Hey guys, Tabby here and welcome back to my channel. So guys, I am beyond excited, as usual, to unbox this box for you guys because it is the limited edition box from Geek Gear and it is their house pride box. So every item in this box will be based off of Gryffindor which you guys know how much I love when we get house specific items. So for an entire box just to be Gryffindor items, my excitement level is like way up here and it should probably be way down here, but I cannot help it guys. I really can't. So ignore me if I geek out this entire video. I apologize in advance. But yeah, that's enough rambling from me. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this box. So if you're interested, keep watching and let's get into it. Let's do a sneak peek and wormies. And the first item, is a pair of socks okay so it really is just a pair of long socks with a G on them um that's I mean okay I mean I like socks I do and they're long but I'm not gonna lie I'm kind of disappointed that this is one of the items I mean it's just a pair of red socks with a G on them I mean, my name could be Georgina. And we get socks all the time, so that is not a very unique item. And it is so plain. I wish they would have at least added some detail maybe to the socks instead of just a G and a very plain G. So I'm a little disappointed, I'm not gonna lie, with the first item. And next we have a red hat with a G on it. It's kind of just like the socks. It's just a red hat with the G on it, which is, again, kind of plain. And I don't really wear hats anyway, so I will probably end up putting this in my giveaway box. Um, but I mean, the first two items we've gotten are just red with G on it. Like, that is just so disappointing because there are so many great things that you could have done instead of a pair of socks and a hat with G on it. And next we have a tie with G on it. Um, I actually do like this tie though. Um, let me take it out real fast. So at least the design on this is a little bit more than just the hat and socks. I mean, it's still just a G, but at least it has a lion on there. So I mean, that's something. But it is good quality and I actually don't have a Gryffindor tie yet, so Okay, I'm actually very happy with this. Again, not a very outside the box thinking item. I'm sure a lot of people already have house ties, but I actually like it. It's good quality, so okay. Guys, I'm sorry. My excitement level went from like up here to like on the floor. Whew. Okay, next we have a mug. Let me de-bubble wrap it. This is a licensed mug. Okay, so it's just the Gryffindor lion, and then it has Gryffindor there with some um, brooms on there. And then it's the same design on both sides, Harry Potter in the middle. Okay, it's not my favorite cup that we've ever gotten before, but I do like that it's just Gryffindor, and I like the design and colors. So, okay, not a bad item. Next, we have some enamel pins. It's two enamel pins. One says, proud to be a wizard, and the other says, proud to be a witch, and it's... The sorting hat, but just red. God, this is going to be the worst video ever. I'm sorry, negative Nelly over here, but I am not a fan of these enamel pins. Like, the only thing they did, I'm assuming, to make this a house-specific item is change the color of the sorting hat. Like, you, there, like there's, there could have been so many amazing enamel pins that they could have done instead of proud to be a witch with a red sorting hat. Like that really is nothing to do with Gryffindor. Like you could have done a Gryffindor ghost. Like you could have done... <sighs> I will say I like that they included one for wizard and witch. So, you know, if you're a guy, you have the wizard. If you're a girl, you have the witch. Um, but honestly, I'm gonna put both of these in my giveaway box. Next, we have an art print. And then last, we have a wand, but we'll do the art print first. Let's see, so it's a lion. I 
I like that it's the kind of art print that they've been doing. It's not my favorite art print. I mean, it's a really good art print. The design, the detail, I mean, that's a realistic looking lion. And last but not least is the wand. Ooh. It is good. I like the wand. Yay! So it is a lion, and the mane kind of looks like it's twisting around. That is gorgeous. The detail is awesome. One thing I will say about Geek Gear is their wands are always on point. So I am a big fan of the wand. You can tell it's really good quality too. But guys, that was it. That was everything from the limited edition box. Let's take a quick look at the spoiler card. So this box had seven items, exclusive house cap, the animal print, the socks, the mug, the wand, the proud to be pin, and the exclusive house tie. So overall thoughts, I think this is the most disappointing I have ever been with a box. And again, it is probably my fault. I was like beyond excited to get a box with just Gryffindor items. I feel like there is so much that they could have done with this box. I mean, there was no out of the box thinking for this box. Literally, two of the items were just red with the G. Like that is beyond disappointing. There could have been house ghost item. There could have been common room items. There could have been like a Gryffindor sword replica in here. Like it didn't have to be big. Like it could have been like a little replica for like maybe the sword for Gryffindor, the diadem for Ravenclaw, the Hufflepuff cup for Hufflepuff, the locket for Slytherin. Like there is so much they could have done. Maybe a lot of people liked this box. I don't know. I try not to watch unboxing videos until I've done mine, but I'm gonna have to watch some to see how people found this box because I'm beyond disappointed. Unless you were like a brand new collector, I don't think you would like this box. <laughs> Again, I'm not saying these items are bad because they're good quality. Like it's good quality socks, a good quality hat. Y'all let me know if you think I'm totally off base, completely wrong, but I mean, y'all let me know if you would have been disappointed with this as well because honestly, the only things I'm gonna keep from this box is the tie, the wand, and the mug. The pins, the art print, the socks, the hat is all gonna go in my giveaway box. I feel sad now. I hope I didn't make anybody watching this feel sad, but this kind of made me sad. <sighs> But as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, hey, welcome. Feel free to hit that subscribe button if you want to join my small community of Harry Potter lovers and bookworms. And I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys. <laughs> Their house bright. Because that is my house. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> Get into it because I'm so excited. <sighs> it is the <laughs> box for you. I'm gonna unbox this box. Did that stupid train? I told you guys every time. Again, my name could be Greg, George, Georgina, Giraffe. I mean, I don't know. <sighs> This is sad. <laughs>